Hey Rick, Scott. Uh, just wanted to show you uh, Blogger, blogger.com, and uh, a couple of blogs that I've written. Blogger is um, available at blogger.com, and what you can do is you can actually create a blog. Very easy. Um, you create an account, um, name your blog, and choose a template. I won't go through those steps with you. It's, it's pretty easy. Um, but I will show you my blog, my blogs as they uh, exist today. So they're, um, oops, and I misspelled my password. Sign in here, and I've got a couple of them: Crazed Meal Productions and uh, Tech Answer Guy. And I'm just going to uh, show you the Crazed Mule blog. And the blog is basically a diary; it's an online diary. And um, I was noticing from uh, my site traffic statistics that I was getting a lot of hits. So I thought, well, let me put up a couple of ads. Let me put a couple of ads on the site. And uh, you do that within the blogger interface. It's basically a JavaScript tags. And uh, you can see at the top of the page I have, uh, well, actually, let me explain first my, my entry on this page happens to be about um, moving my RAID set to a new box. RAID set is just a redundant array of inexpensive disks. And basically that's, uh, you know, I'm a computer geek so I know about that crap. Um, and uh, so, so I have ads here uh, related to the content on my page like Fix Boudini, Shop CPU. Um, if I scroll down on the page a little bit I'll have some more ads about uh, HDTV Ready Raid. So um, Google takes care of that for me. It it creates the context sensitive ads and then it sells those ads to advertisers. And uh, I get a small cut of the profit. Now, if uh, to look at that, you'd actually go to um, Google AdSense. And again, it's you know password protected site. And if I sign in, oops, and I spelled my password again. If I log into Google AdSense here, um, I can see that today I don't have any earnings. Uh, there are 71 total page impressions and nobody clicked on anything. So, But if I looked at the top, top channels, I can see that, um, well, these ones uh, labeled CM are Crazed Mule and the others labeled all are for my other blog called uh, Tech Answer Guy and they're uh, you know they've been both been getting some hits uh, the Tech Answer Guy gets a little a um, few more page views uh, than the other one uh, Crazed Mule but if I look at uh, yesterday's earning stats um, actually uh, two clicks and I earned 19 cents where did I earn that from? I earned well the one click one click from the uh, bottom ad that I have on Crazed Mule and another on the uh, top below the header on my uh, Tech Answer Guy blog. So that's pretty cool. But what I'd um, another interesting thing is actually looking at your statistics on your site and you do that again through uh, Google and uh, it's a package called Analytics and it's free you just again have to put in a piece of JavaScript tag in, into that blog, into that blogger interface on your template and that's really easy um, but if I look at my uh, Crazed Meal Productions blog stats it loads up here it takes a little time to load the, uh, the dashboard dashboard widget, oh you know what dashboard widget isn't available in this version of Firefox um, you won't have that problem <laughs> but um, just what you can do uh, you won't get the pretty graphs here but I'll show you anyway there are uh, 944 visits to the site this was the period of the last month I uh, have page views of you know 1300 page views page visits uh, bounce rate pretty neat stuff um, the neatest stuff is basically hey how did how did they get to my site um, and you can look at all traffic sources so in the past month people have been getting to my site via different methods 
Uh, a lot of people just know about the site, direct or none, so they come directly to my site. Uh, the other is uh, through Google. A lot of people coming through Google, about 75. Uh, well, let's see, out of total, looks like probably 50%. But um, a couple of sites have linked to me, and that's pretty cool. Now, what you can also do is um, you can look at the keywords people came in on. That was my uh, cell phone going off. And the keywords basically tell uh, tell us what words that people were searching on that led them to my site. So in this particular instance, um, in the last month, um, there's some technical stuff. M window in it, theme SUV not found. That was an error I encountered. Uh, right frame, frame failed. Another error I encountered, Sinalera which is the uh, editing software on Linux that I use and a whole bunch of similar stuff. So that's pretty neat. Tells you where they came in from. Also what you can look at is um, where they are coming from. So if I click on uh, the segment, keyword segment country, I can see that well, most of them are from the US, but there's the UK, Germany, Australia, Canada, Italy, <laughs> Netherlands, Philippines, France, India. If you actually wanted to see the whole list, because there's like 43 pages, uh, or 43 uh, different countries people have come in and in on in the last month, you can uh, just extend that list out and see Portugal, Russia, Poland, Brazil, Norway. It's, it's pretty, pretty awesome. So you can also look at what people are looking at on your site. If you click on content, uh, you can look at the top content report. And the content report will uh, show you, let me just expand the window here a little bit. Uh, okay, there we go. Uh, beginner's Guide. I've written a Beginner's Guide, and that's real popular. So that gets the most hits. And then I have, the, have some other blog entries that are, you know, subtly popular, uh, less popular. Uh, putting HDV from Sinalera, uh, Chroma Key Test. So neat stuff. Anyway, um, that's that's about it. I also have uh, most of my um, videos that I've linked from Crazed Mule. Um, they're on YouTube. Obviously you know that, so uh, you're kind of familiar with that. I don't have to tell you about that. But anyway, they all mesh. All these different tools mesh to give you a real, you know, you build a killer website from just these freely available tools on the web. Anyway, that's it, man. Talk to you later. Bye.